Hello guys, welcome. Thank you for all the patience. Uh, Speedster was having a few issues with his PS4, but we are all good to go. Um, so yeah, we've got Speedster versus some random person. I am joined today by Yanini. Hello, welcome. Thanks for having me. Welcome, welcome. Um, and yeah, I'm kind of a bit all over the place. We've been waiting for a little bit, a little little while. Um, but looking forward to this one. It's a, fair, it's a round one match. This is the final round one match. Um, and this will decide, I believe, who goes on to play Chris in the next round. Um, I think that's the case, yeah. Yeah, and we will be seeing... We will definitely be seeing Santa Fortuna, Haven and Chong King today. And then we may see Mumbai and Paris, depending on uh, how the first three maps go. So a nice set of maps. We've got the three of the big five. Um... Which is going to be fun, and we've seen lots of exciting matches on Santa Fortuna and Mumbai so far, definitely. Haven, we all know what Haven's like, so... Um... <laughs> yeah, for sure, that's true. And, um, I mean, especially with, with uh, I mean, Sweet Style and Neek, uh, a twist, like, the freedom is even greater on those maps, you know? So you can um, choose even more, so I think, yeah, it makes for makes yeah. for a very good uh, game to watch. Yeah, personally, I, I think Santa Fortuna is like the pinnacle of this game mode, sort of outside of Berlin, just because of the way the targets are placed. And like Mumbai, you've mm. still got an easy kind of maelstrom, unless you get some condition that stops you from being able to get him early. Haven is just Haven. We, I don't think we've, I don't think we've seen a Colorado yet. I might be wrong about that, but I don't actually think we've seen a Colorado spin yet. But I think that's going to be very exciting as well when we get to that. But um, sure, yeah, yeah. Santa Fortuna is probably my favourite so far to watch. Um, spin is here. Do you want to run this one down? Yeah, surely. Uh, we have explosive weapon as coke field worker, SMG as man's staff, and kitchen knife as elite guard. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's always see. a bit hard to overview because of all the possibilities. Yeah, um, I mean, you, could see, you might see an early Rico with the mansion staff, potentially, or an early Jorge with the Coco field. Um, or yeah, even an early uh, my, with the Elite very be too. Yeah, they kind of all sit in place with each one, but, but then each kind of starting point could cause you to go different ways, so... Yeah, um, that's no for sure true, and I, uh, also some, like, kitchen knife, knife elite guard, kitchen knife, there are plenty, so, um, should be okay, and, yeah. of course, of course, you, as you said, you could uh, either, like, for example, start with Jorge or start with Rico immediately, um, but of course, there's also the, um, it's the weapon, explosive weapon is also a setup, so it means that uh, it might very well also be be uh well something to think about here for example yeah uh, random you, just you might try uh, start something in the caves yeah exactly start a submarine and looks to be uh yeah, gonna wait for rico to come here and might very well be the close up and kill them notice this has become quite a popular start point now hasn't it the uh, submarine so it's a nice start point that we've seen quite a lot it's a bit different yeah I suppose being in the caves kind of gives you access to both Rico and Jorge if you need it. Um, but, I mean, yeah, this is this is quite a forgiving spin, you would say. Like nothing overly difficult in the conditions, but we've got two different yeah. starting points. Um, Speedster's chosen to go Elite Guard and probably Andrea first, so we're going to see two different competing strats. Oh, which is also interesting because, like. Talked about Coco Field and uh, Main Star, of course, but you know, Main Start, uh, grabbing the Elite Guard uh, very early could also be a very nice, very nice option. He yeah. looked for himself to grab a kitchen knife somewhere. <laughs> Ooh, big wish we get to pass. Yeah, there's one in the chef's room, isn't there? Or is that just. Yeah, there should be a kitchen knife in with the chef. Uh, yeah, I do think so. That would be the obvious one to go for, and being an elite guard, he doesn't have to, uh, worry about it. Uh, Rico's on the run. Okay, so he's got red guns, but that's from Rico seeing the hippo whisper us, so that's not a problem. Should be fine. Gives him the pillow, and yeah, okay, so, so straight away we're seeing 
like you said, uh, an explosive weapon um, set up. So he's possibly going to take the mansion staff and the SMG to get Jorge, and then he's got the Coco Field Worker in the same place. Or potentially yeah. other, you know, the elite guard, so he can get. He's effectively going to get two kills in the Coco Fields, you would imagine, and, and go about it that way. That might very well be the case, and but of course, Mansion staff is trespassing in the Coco Fields. But it, no, it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be a problem. It's, uh, people manage that all the time, just like looking for um, things that are. I mean, just not as quite convenient. Yeah, is the elite guard, um, I assume the elite guard tries passing there as well, or is he... In, in the cobble fields? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not 100% sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Trespassing zone. Um, Only he is too... Only that the mansion staff isn't trespassing there, so... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my, knowledge, my knowledge of Santa yeah. Fortuna is uh, not as good as other maps. I mean, so, mine isn't either, but, you know, we're all, um, le all learning constantly. Um, now Speedster this time uh, didn't grab the, the elite guard immediately. Just uh, like he restarted because he well he missed it, kind of missed the timing. Ooh, yeah, missed, the missed the shot on the box. Should be okay, but he's gonna have to get Andrea out of there. Yeah, Oof. should nice. be okay. The guard shouldn't. Yeah, that's fine. But we will know that that is still a possibility. Um, the bullet impact should be fine. And um, yeah, we're on his way to the cover fields. I mean, Randy loves this map, doesn't he? He 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 will pick this map at any given opportunity. He does. So, um, he's definitely at home here. He does. Um, picked up a seeker from the looks of it, yeah. and probably gonna look uh, look to get uh, that yeah, kill down Sam soon. Jorge. I assume he bought an SMG in with him. Or he's planning on getting one of the guards. Um... I'm not sure. Like he definitely picked up one from the mansion guards, but the loud one, of course. I don't know if he, I don't think he has a silent one, okay, uh, but so I might be mistaken there. Loud could be risky. Should be okay, but it could be a little bit risky. Depends where the guards yeah. are when he uh, yeah goes for it. I think it should be fine either way, but you know we'll see. Um, yeah, Speedster went the safer way this time. Uh, uh, grabbed the uh, just killed Andrea and oh doesn't doesn't go back. Uh, just think. Did he give uh, so gonna... I didn't. Did he give her a breach? I didn't see. Uh, I didn't see either. But that might it might actually be yeah. That might be the smartest thing to do here, and yeah. then just go on with the elite guard. Yeah, I think that makes a lot of sense. I mean, you've got two. I mean, Jorge and I mean, all three of these technically are non-trespassing if you go for the kind of correct target yeah. combo. So. Well, in theory, to worry about. well, in theory, yes, but you know, um, might still not be the uh, the best way, as both players demonstrate here. And um, yeah, so that's, it's uh, also makes sense. Now, uh, random got the the kill and apparently had a silent with Muji, so it's very nice, very safe. Yeah, so one down and one. He's just about to get the cocoa field worker. The, the... Three, one, technically. Um, maybe easy to get with no issues, and Rico will be exploding very soon. Yep, so two targets down. None for Speedster yet. In for fun saying he didn't put the Breacher down for Andrea, so he's going to have to go uh, there hmm. as well. That'll be interesting, because, like, uh, I think it would have made him a lot of sense, and he could have. Uh... There's a few, I mean, there's definitely a kitchen knife in the village. It seems kind of odd that he maybe he's just not realised it's there, but it would seem kind of odd. Maybe that. And do that. Um, maybe he hasn't realised. They're kind of scattered. I mean, it's a possibility. The map, really, aren't they? The it's a possibility. Map. But maybe he also wants to uh, keep that explosive weapon kill uh, for Jorge, cause, just because the uh, coca field worker is. Um, it's the only guy in the spin that is allowed there, you know, so like, yeah. I don't know, <laughs> so he doesn't have to infiltrate, uh, like, run around the, uh, um, with the, the um, trespass in disguise too often, but anyway, um, I so in his room, so he's yes. one guard down in the toilet, so he's just, he looks like he's just going for ISOs and then, yeah, come back, get disguises and come back for kills. Which is interesting. I mean, I think uh, the setup. I think he de does plan on killing him with elite guard. Where he brought it up there, but he does want to get the kitchen knife first, and yeah, yeah. probably gonna get wrapped one from below. I don't know. Is there any? Is there any like super easy mansion staff disguises to get? Um, you saw really uh, well, the other one yeah, in the, the base. Basement. In the basement, I would say. Okay. Sure. 
Let's go. Uh, he's kind very of quick exit always. Yeah, so he's got the kitchen knife, so... So maybe even looking at SMG. He's either forgotten to put the breach or he's looking for SMG for Andrea, potentially. Um, we'll find out soon. Uh, yeah. Random is on his way to Andrea. Um, he has looked very smooth so far. Hard agree. Um, and he doesn't have a lot uh, left to do. Uh, he's in the red. He's already in the elite guard. Um, not sure. Yeah, so, yeah, so many variations of this disguise. I'm used to <laughs> That's true. <laughs> um, and it's very good adrenaline timing as well. Yeah, perfect timing. It's any method, so obviously thrown or melee doesn't matter. Takes the knife back just for good measure. <laughs> That's my knife, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, just gets caught on the cameras. That shouldn't be an issue, but we have seen people rip to these cameras so many times, and he's got That's a true. <laughs> as well. Oh my. Super risky. I think he's got. Oh my god. god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh my god. He. <laughs> he the guy, like, like, he actually, like, he crouched and then uncrouched in front of the window. Yeah, but because the really triple. But he did. Oh my god. That, that could have gone so wrong. My god. <laughs> just, trying to, just trying to get the nerves up. Yep. On the first That map. could have gone That's, very uh, wrong. But... That was extremely solid. I mean, not. Yeah. A bit of a forgiving spin, yeah, but still, an eight minute, eight minute sounds called tuna. I mean, yeah, when you play it as clean as you really can, so yeah, no, um, very deserved first map for him. Yeah, eight and a half minutes, one and done. So, and uh, yeah, now we have Haven to look forward to. Ooh, um, <laughs> very nice. We've seen again, seen some interesting Havens. Very um, nice. And this, yeah, this is another one that can throw up some really interesting spins, um, especially in regard to Tyson. Tyson's kind of... With Miller and Steven aren't overly difficult on this map, but Tyson can be a real nightmare with the wrong conditions. Well, yeah. Um, so actually, this could be... Yeah. I know we had one the other day where they were, they were chatting and saying, oh, live kills aren't really optimal for, for Tyson. And then it came up. The spin came up and live kill was the optimal for Tyson. So you just... You never know. <laughs> yeah, you, you never know. That's true. Um, but for sure, it does help that... Uh, I think Tyson is, is often... Uh, the fact that you have them have a problem, like would like a condition to be different, so it could make it a lot easier to um, you know to, to choose your condition for Tyson. But what is optimal, of course, will I will we'll see about that. Um, but it could be interesting for sure. Yeah. Um, anything particularly you want to see on this one? I say normally live, games, <laughs> but not quite so bad on Haven. No, it's really, really quite fine. Um, I mean, I'm not sure. Um, I, th I think it's like the, I think like the most difficult thing is probably like the oh, most well, most complicated. Probably falling objects still, because um, well, you have two options. You either wait for Steven, it's quite a while. I have to incorporate that, or I mean, Tyson also requires a bit of setup and time. So I feel like that could be, could be still interesting. Yeah, well, the other option is um, uh, serverless, which is that is always an option. Boo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, search, um, that's fine. it's totally like, valid option, of course. Yeah. Um, I I like a serverless myself. A triple serverless is always interesting to watch as well. But um, it is kind of it's the super safe option in some ways. Um, yeah. Um, you know, I have, I have some, some personal vendetta against it, but, um, but it's, but for sure it's, it's a viable option and can definitely sometimes be ideal. Um, so, yeah, this so spin team. will be underway in around a minute. Yes. So, in the chat, falling object, machete, boat captain, snorkel strap, and any any difficult to obtain suit essentially coming up in spin. Yeah, <laughs> well, that makes makes sense. <laughs> any, any <suit. laughs> what you want to see as viewer, yeah. <laughs> I think yeah, the, the kill conditions on Haven possibly aren't 
the problem in as much as Haven is the problem. <laughs> I think I think I mean, it can be. I mean, you can avoid it very nicely, but it, it, it can be for sure. Haven. Yeah, I mean, uh, these guys, uh, you, you'd hope. I mean, a lot of the season roulette players know their way around the map. Um, oh, and yes. know where to avoid things. Spin is here. I will run this one down. We have folding knife, any method, as the waiter. Silenced SMG as the tech crew and a shotgun as the boat captain. So one unique disguise, the boat captain. Yeah. Um, folding knife is a little bit out of the way, but you do also need tech crew, so they kind of go hand in hand. Well, I think um, the most interesting, th or most noteworthy thing here is that we have a shotgun and a silent SMG. So yes, if you would want to bring in a silent shotgun as well, that means you well either have to you know I mean. I'm taking a seeker for granted. So like, <laughs> so either have to start suit or um, it's quite possible. Yeah, but it's, no it occupies a lot of map is there. No, Maybe and it occupies a lot of lot of slot already. So yeah. yeah. So random's going for. I saw mansion start there. I didn't see where speedster was starting. And he started suit, but I'm not sure which one. Okay. He I mean, did bring suit... in a, a silent for G. Yeah, I mean you could go for a very uh, I mean, lockdown of Miller. Um, Lock her down into the second hut. Um, okay, no, he started. Okay, so he's probably going to go for an early Steven with the Seeker kind of standardized route. Um, and or Seeker, Tyson. Yeah. Peekaboo, maybe. Yeah. Um, that that seems to be uh, a lot of players like start to start for. Yeah. Um, it's a tricky one. I've always struggled. I've always struggled personally with the Peekaboo. I know some players do struggle with it. Um, it's, it's a very powerful way to get him if you can oh uh, well points. yeah you know it, it can be uh, like yeah server lure and tyson peekaboo can both both be viable methods but uh, sometimes and a uh, random in the though tempting yeah, this caught, uh yeah he caught his attention yeah. but he got away with it yeah very nice uh it's the patented uh, uh curry lure <laughs> gonna luring... okay went for a restart there not but Tyson, sure why I think Tyson didn't move, but it, it should have worked, to be honest. Same. Is he try? Is he actually trying to get Tyson down with that then? Well, yeah, yeah, that's that's the that's, that's the lure, uh, okay, and yeah, yeah. Sorry, um, it it looked to, that it, uh, yeah, it, like, yeah, it was like spot, uh, stash him in a specific time when he's like a specific spot, yeah. and then um, it gains enough peekaboo without being uh, spotted. But you yeah, know that uh, it looked to me like it should have worked, but. I don't know why it didn't, so that's a restart for, for random. Because you're not losing too much time here. Only, I mean, 40 seconds. Not yeah, it, it's totally decent. Time. And, you know, it makes us all sense for Tech Crew, like, instead of the cinema, because Tech Crew's not allowed in there. And, of course, Tech Crew, you know, you have already had that guys here, so that could be a quite fast Titan kill. Yeah. That should definitely have been enough. He's probably got time, to, okay, got time to go down and get the folding knife in between as well. If he chooses, probably, or he's yes. just gonna go stay up here. Probably, yeah. It's a lot. It's very efficient here, for sure. Uh, I, I like it a lot. I've never actually seen that. I've seen that used accidentally as a lure. I've never actually seen <laughs> that used deliberately as a lure. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's it's very cool. Yeah. Uh, speedster, meanwhile, has Steven down. I assume he also got Ludmilla down. I was kind of focused on. Uh, yeah, same. But I, but I do think so. Yeah, I, I, I would assume that. And um, well, yeah, sure. Uh, just has to collect some waiter, boat captain disguises. It's a full. Uh, of course, folding knife will have to to wait a little. Uh, in the meantime, random grabbed a shotgun, a uh, large shotgun from the secret room. So you also have have that now. Yeah, and again with the seeker. Um, both Blood Miller and Steven isolate themselves in soundproof rooms, so that shouldn't be too much of an issue yep. on this map. Yep. Mason is down. Uh, totally fine. Um, yeah, grab the bodyguard guy, of course. Uh, allows him to move more freely. Uh, still needs to grab the folding knife, but then he can leave the villa and just doesn't yeah. have to go back boat, there. Boat captain can be a bit tricky. Um, yes. There's a couple of different ways to get him. I've seen bananas briefcases thrown over the edge. I think that's what Speedster is possibly trying to do. Looks to be, yeah. yeah. You just kind of get it into his vision, don't you, and he comes down. 
There we go, he's got it that time, he's got the question mark. Very nice. Very nicely done. Um, random yeah. Oh, that was a risky KO from random there. <laughs> oh man, yeah. <laughs> you know, he turned it very nicely with the bumps, so I'll run on him. Okay, folding knife. So yeah, he is going to be out of the server and the villa. Very, very nice. Um, meanwhile, Feaster now grabbed the boat captain in the in the bush uh, after loading him down, and it's looking to yeah, you see a Miller uh, set up there. Uh, it's gonna look to get that second kill done. He also has the talent. He brought on the talent shotgun so. That should be no issue here. And red guns, I'm guessing, are from Steven, aren't they? Because he got the he just got. I, I yeah, he side KO'd him. I think that should be it. Good minute. So that missed, unfortunately. And the second shot. We got to be careful with this box because you can be seen. Nope, he's fine. Yes. Very nice one. Um, Ran now. Oh, random stream has gone down for me. Yeah, uh, same. That's not good. Uh, let's see. I mean, now oh, it's game playing game. at me right now, but uh, let's see. <laughs> let's see get him back. She's just restarted the game, so that's going to put him on. Oh, game. man. I don't. Probably won't be a re spin in this case because Speedster isn't. Well, he wasn't, he wasn't on target to uh, directly win that one. Yeah, it was uh, like, yeah. I mean, but he was looking very good, so that's uh, yeah. that's quite sad. And also, I believe that also um, that increases the photo finish window to three minutes, doesn't it? So, um, um, yeah. Game crash is that right? So, so okay. he's got yeah. So he's got a little bit of leeway in that photo finish as well. So let's hope he can get back in. And he looked he looked like he had a solid strat there. Indeed. Um, back in motion again. Quite solid. Mm, wow. But well, um, I just see uh, Speed running against himself for now. Yeah, and Speed um, obviously still has to deal with Tyson as well. Um, yes, but that should be fine. Um, yes, one kill down, which means. Uh, he, oh, he's gonna pick up a banana. Nice. <laughs> um, um, he still needs a folding knife. From the villa, so he can't kill. I mean, we assume that's what he's gonna do for uh, for Steven. So he has to go back to Steven at the end. But uh, also, I mean, also he could also do the tech. It doesn't really matter. I think to grab a radar here, so Ooh, probably he's gonna very quick here. I think the guy is on his yeah, way back. Gonna leave him. Gonna leave him behind the table. Oh my! That I mean, that works. Really? <laughs> really gets wow. Oh, cool. oh okay. Quick thinking, panic the guy, panic the uh, other guy, and get him out of there. Very oh, nice. that was nicely done, yeah. That was very nice. Um, well, Random is now back into the game, luckily, and is doing that lure again for Tyson. So yeah, I mean, his plan was very solid. Uh, didn't didn't go wrong. So I just hope you can repeat it. Um, yeah, he's also. I mean, it's he's like he's in on the back foot. He's about five and a half minutes behind now, but one rip and that could be uh, back even. Of course, yeah. We'll just see how this goes. He's to make his way into the villa. So of course, always possible. Gonna to, he's going to have to go back out at some point um, to get the Miller, but he just steps into the cameras, and that's a rip. Oh no, speedster! Oh man, he was looking very. Oh, he was looking so good. And uh, oh. uh, catches many people out, unfortunately. Yep. Uh, I was not quite sure what um what, like where you want to catch Tyson looked to be like uh in the um in the uh, jacuzzi room maybe. Yeah, but I'm yeah. Sure on his cycles and how what time he gets, but he's got quite a long cycle, I think, hasn't he? So. Yeah, but he can lure him there with his with his shkudi, so that's okay. Ah, uh, yes, of course you can. Yeah. Um, yeah, so it doesn't really matter where the lure. Yes, but like a decently long lure, like five to six minutes. Yeah. Um. 
Yeah. Piece of stick uh, in the steam strat. It. Yeah, it, it did work out quite well for him. It was it well, like I, I would say now it's a bit longer than Randy's strat from what I've seen so far. Um, yeah. um but it, it was for sure solid. It, uh, it worked for Ra him that Ra far. Randy's man to optimize his obviously by getting everything done in the villa first and then going out, whereas Feast has kind of yep. done it the opposite way. But the problem with that is that it means Feast has to go back out yes. to get with Miller, so that's where he's going to lose a bit of time on his. Indeed. Oh, so nice you can snipe. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Not a shot to it here. Um, from that angle. <laughs> oh. Yeah, and I'm gonna first kill down again. Uh, and it's on his way. Yeah. Obviously free, kind of free-ish waiter. Um, in that little room. So boat captain's really his only, uh, his only challenge, I would say now. Uh, that's, I think that's, yeah, very fair to say, and of course to hit, uh, hit your seeker shot. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> it's also, mm, depending on the angle and stuff, it can, can be uh, tricky as well. Uh, at first, random. Gonna leave the evidence here, and then he's really got to go out of the villa. Okay, looks like he's gonna go, sh he's... Metic to the boat captain. Oh wow, okay. Uh, I guess yeah, I guess I had to uh <laughs> re the stream and then it was like thirty, 30 <laughs> seconds behind, yeah. <laughs> uh well that's good to know. <laughs> but um noteworthy here is that he's gonna miss Steven. So he's gonna either have to take care of him on this island or yeah. uh, wait for him to get back in around nine minutes. Yeah, which might work out depending on. I mean, it's good. This, this boat captain is taking his time and he's still going to get the Miller, so nine minutes might work out just about. Um, but we'll see. I think he's still going to have to wait a bit, but yeah, it might work out. It should, should. Um, definitely, it's quite a long wait for him to <laughs> finally get down. Uh, the boat captain is uh, walking as slow as humanly possible here. Excruciatingly slow, yeah. <laughs> it really is. I hide him in the, in the other bathroom so stall. The bathroom, yeah, just to make yeah. sure that Miller doesn't find him. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he does not want to be hidden there. Uh, let's try that again. <laughs> hey! Well, we got the challenge for Skyling as boat captain. Um... <laughs> Nice to see. Gonna get Chameleon to pop. Speedster, I mean, Speedster definitely looks like he's going the same route. Um, just waiting for the boat captain to come over. Like you say, a bit slower, but it seemed safe um, up until running into the camera, but that's probably just a bit yeah. of roulette brain. Weird. Can, of course, happen. I mean, uh, uh, that camera is all like, you run into it, and then you, like, it starts to spot you, and then you, uh, if you run out of it, the range is kind of bigger, so like, it's hard to yeah, run out of it. It seems um, to not, yeah, you can't get back out once you've, uh, once you've yeah. gone into its range, it's kind of caught you. Pretty, pretty much, it's, it was just really weird, you know, that the range is just bigger, um, walking out of it, but, you know, that's just how it works. Um, now, Random is standing here, got his shotgun, shotgun ready. Uh, that shotgun might be found by yeah, the other guard, got, yeah, he's got but... Guard doesn't see that. I think he's gonna KO him anyway, probably then. Yeah. Um, it should be okay. Yeah, it looks like yeah. he is. Wrench. Just to hide him as well. Uh, but first, gonna take the shot on Luke Miller. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a bit, and there you go. That's the kill down. Just to hide the guard now, and he should be. It's on route for his third kill. Yeah, so he's at seven minutes, so he's got a decision to make here. Does he go over to the island, or does he just wait it out? Um, I think he should wait, and like, he, does, yes, yeah, he also has to go to the waiter. Yeah. yeah. So... I mean, Who's in roulette, like, if, yeah. if you're... <laughs> most often, if you have, like, a decision, you either wait, or you try to speed it up a little. Like, 99% is good to wait, because... <laughs> um, yeah. 
you know, but just take your time, more patient, just instead of pumping something you're not, not percent, or not percent comfortable with. One KO, two KOs. This room can be wall hacked. It's rare. <laughs> yes, time. from quite a far distance as well. So like, it's a bit careful, but looks looks to be good. Yeah. You'll definitely want to put that other body away just to be sure. Yeah. That is for sure true, and it's gonna do that. So very nice. Looking looking very on on route uh, to a map victory here. Yeah, speedsters back in the villa. Um, he looks to have gone there a little bit earlier this time. Uh, changed into the boat captain, so he might be going for the shotgun kill on Tyson this time. Yeah, he didn't Maybe. do that on uh, yeah, on on on, on her uh, uh, on on the Miller. Go, I guess possibly going into the um, going down into the server and and get the tech crew and folding knife, which means he's got two targets outside but that's not too much of an issue might just be the case early this time Ooh, it's interesting so Getting now gonna uh -huh. so this is interesting in room. tyson doesn't come into so... his room of his own accord i believe no 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 he's gonna he's gonna yeah this is nice he, he, he's distracted the outer guard looking inside and he distracted this guard with a shot so that you can go over um, to the cinema room. It's a very nice rounding through the house. That was, uh, yeah, great route. And uh, Tyson is also coming, so it's also great timing. Yep, and Random's just got the seeker shot on Steven, so he's en route to the toilet. So, um, he's got his folding hey, knife. On? Who's there? Yeah, he's gonna have a kind of routine spin from here. Yeah, it's super good for him. I mean, uh, speeds allow like he now has all three targets isolated. But ah uh, man, if that would have uh, been the case in the first, uh, the first time he did, he would have won this one. But uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah also reset. I mean, when his game also crashed, you know. But, um, uh, and speed reset, so yeah, very nice done from random. Uh, basically first try. <laughs> yeah, and he I got, he looks very confident on these bigger maps. Really. He looks right oh, sure. on these maps, so... Um... Yeah. For sure. We've got Chonking coming up next. We've got a smaller map, but that um, is Tyson yeah, that's going to be 2 0. Random, Please two solid, I'd say two very solid uh, runs, only, only hampered by the game crash. Indeed, uh, sick. On course for for victory here, of course, best of best of five crash. So um, if he wins one more, that will be uh, the match win, and Speed will be eliminated. Yes, this is a round one match, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> yep. The okay, case, and as we as we said earlier, Winner will play against Chris, um, yep. likely tomorrow, from what I heard. Yeah, I think the soft deadline is. Possibly, I think the soft deadline is Monday, so they're probably yeah just trying to make sure they uh get that done. We've had a lot of matches in in a row, kind of over the first couple of days, which is always always to be yeah. expected. But um, well, they'll start coming. In. Ho hopefully, one a day ish will be good for uh for everybody. Yeah, people are quite quite eager to get the matches in, which was yeah. nice to see. <laughs> um, also a lot of work, but yeah, that's that's very cool. And yeah, now Chongqing. Yeah. Coming up at 32 minutes past. Um, one thing I have got to do is run down the uh, the bands on each map. Chongqing, consume poison and fire. So not a lot is banned on this map. Um, obviously, things are banned when it's any anything that is really obvious that you're always going to go for one target over the other is banned. Um, consumed is banned just because you can't really do consumed on Imogen. Um, or you can't on hush actually. Or you, you can kind of do consumed <laughs> on both with the. All that possible, but <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
Both yeah. you got you got ventilation for both of them. Both of them are kind of long winded and kind of not really. Yeah. Don't really it just sucks. Roulette, in my opinion. So um, and also yeah. fire. Not only you can only do that in the core. So um, another tedious condition. But any any other than that, anything else goes. Um, be nice to see. I'm not sure on this map. Like again, live ki uh, loud live kills. Loud, loud pistol elimination is the big one, I think, on any map. Um, that causes problems. Yeah. Uh, might be sure the case, because, like, yeah, you have to leave up the target, but also you gotta make sure it's kind of soundproof, or, well, at least uh, you can stash them away quickly enough, or, like... No, it, it, it sounds very difficult for some targets, uh, uh, for most targets, actually. So, you know. Yeah, and on, on most maps, having at least one live kill kind of makes things interesting because then you've got to choose straight away who is your live kill and on chong king it's probably not likely to be hush unfortunately um depending on what the disguise and kill combo is hush is a nightmare to get if he if he leaves that little room so probably mostly see a live kill on imogen maybe we'll get lucky and see a double live kill um that would spice things up a bit yep uh, yeah, spin should be here any second. And it's your turn to run this one down. Will do, will do. Still have like, yeah, we still have half a minute. So. Let's see. Um, but yeah, I think it was just pretty much as I explained, of course. Chung Ching, we, we all know that Hush is, is a top priority. Yeah, um, I mean, you might even see him go down, again, depending on disguise and kill conditions, you might even see him go down quickly. We, you, there's a number of different lures. Imogen can be got a number of different ways. You tend to go for the, the drone lure, but um, Indeed. there's always time for something a bit different. Let's just hope the spin gives us something a bit interesting. Well, let's see, we got a Fire Axe as Facility Engineer. And thrown to theirs as the perfect test subject. Um, it's kind of forgiving. Well, um, it is. Um, the perfect perfect test, test subject kind of writes itself. Hush. Yes, it does. Um, obviously, the scissors are down at the. Is it, uh, there might be more than one pair. The pair I know of is at the bottom. There are the two pairs of scissors, yeah. Yeah, there's one at the bottom of the apartment block, isn't there? Which is the. Yeah, kind of the which is off. And for, yep. And there's also some scissors in the. I'm not even sure how many. But there's scissors in the. I like, know uh, where the laundry is, but that's a bit out of the way. So it's, yeah. You know. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna see a block guard star. Um. Fire axe. Think... Any. I mean, you, again, you got you got to go down for the facility engineer, um, which can, which is a little bit time consuming. But... Yeah. And random does start in the facility, which is interesting. Yeah. Interesting. He's gonna get the. Uh, well. Facility engineer first, maybe. Yeah, I can't see. I can't see him going scissors and perfect test subject for Imogen. I, I just don't, unfortunately, <sighs> don't think that's going to happen. It would be too far out of the way. You, you'd be going opposite side of the maps for each kind of kill method doing it that way. But it's interesting again to see two different house, so start points. Um, Surely. Competing strats almost. Surely that is the case. Um, and I'm gonna. Well, he has to try. It's <laughs> the wall first, yeah. I uh, think he doesn't. Yeah, doesn't try to remember how yeah, to do that. So a or a bullet in that wall can also lure someone around. Yeah. Um. Well. Is there a fire axe in the facility? That I don't know. Um... <sighs> That is a good question. I have one no idea of fire access. No, there's yeah. two in the block, actually, isn't there? There's one on the very top floor of the block, and there's one on the floor down. Don't yeah, yeah, yeah. Any other fire axes? Um, I don't either. Um, but you know, might might be. Um, I, I'm not sure. But anyway, Speedster tried to isolate Hush at the video screen. Um, but uh, well, uh, <laughs> I also forget her name. Sister Lay, I think. You know, she, uh, yeah, you gotta be careful there. She I mean, saw yeah. him, yeah, she saw his body, which of course happened after 40 seconds. Yeah. So, I agree. 
you either need a bullet distract or just a little bit of waiting generally to yes. get that. One of those. So, um, Random's just oh. following Imogen down these stairs. Now he could I yeah. her here, I believe. I think this is a viable it, it, place to to get her. Could be a possibility. Um, she's the only person who comes down these stairs, but um, kind of lost. Okay, it looks like he's gonna. Guard. Yeah, he's just gonna go in her guard. I mean, yeah, it's ex with the guard access and and come grab her. The engineer. Um, I'm not sure if you can if you can like viably ask that in the core room. Not sure about that. Yeah, um, but definitely some interesting approaches here. Uh, it's not as yeah. Work out where to throw this. Uh, gonna get the guard if he does that, but that's not. That put that SMG down. <laughs> yes, OP. Again, unfortunately. Yeah, I think so, the same thing even. Not sure though. Um, but yeah, for sure, interesting. Like, it's not uh, straightforward as we uh, as we thought we would see it. So, random now has uh, taken care of a guard. Let's see. Yeah, we've got him out of the way. The, the engineer's kind of free now. Um, no one else roams in this area. Yeah, just gonna get okay. Not gonna be able to get into that suit, unfortunately. <laughs> but, uh... oh. <laughs> That, that coin is gone for random. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, so yeah, distract is the female. Ooh, oh no! Oh, Ooh, oh, oh man! Push through, I think... through those windows, but yeah. that was. Uh... Oh yeah, I mean I thought so as well, and then I, <laughs> and then like, oh man, and then I, I thought so as well, and I thought like, oh this could be nice, <laughs> like I pushed directly, and then he pushed, and then afterward, like I mean Randy, of course, like he just. Would have assumed that as well, and then it said eliminate. Ah oh, man. <laughs> yeah, that's. I mean, that's not a very. That's not a very big fall. You wouldn't have thought that would be an eliminate, but. Oh. Some of these how is it an elimination? I'm. I'm not sure. Yeah, some of these windows are coded a bit strangely. Can't, yeah, can't really like what what. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that makes yeah, no sense. I mean, I, that's not I, even I, height difference there. Like, yeah, it's literally I, the I same. I would one. never have assumed that was an eliminate. So uh, yeah. I, yeah, everywhere else it would be a dump, like a yeah, pacification thingy. Uh, but well, now we know. <laughs> <laughs> Speeds to with a little bit time, uh, about thirty seconds in the lead, forty seconds ish. Again, competing strats, so. He's got the perfect test subject, just got to go down and get the scissors. Um, we'll probably shoot a drone on his way out, I imagine. Start the image in lure. I mean, yeah, could, like, could also do that on his way back. He has time, he, he's, it will take some time to get the scissors, you know, so... Um, don't want Imogen there too yeah, early. Yeah, early. the engineer actually is a not, not the quickest of disguises, is it? So yeah, true, he might decide not to go straight for he's it. Dead. Even that, yeah, additionally. Um, we have pieces looking for scissors, but there are no scissors here, if I'm not mistaken. Um, oh, well, he's looking for the fire axe. Yeah, they have the fire axe. Um, so maybe. Um, let's see. They actually found a fire axe and they're going to transport that down for now. <laughs> but he, yeah, I think yeah, I believe the only fire axes are in the block, so they're going to have to go back over there. Which again is where Speedster has a little bit of the upper hand in there. Ooh, this is <laughs> interesting for random. He does a bit, he? It's gotten the engineer just in time, and it's now ignoring Imogen. You know, I enjoy your company. That's nice. It uh, looks like he's gonna carry that up to Hush. He might just use the stand. Yeah, he might just use this. Okay, so he's possibly gonna go opposites, which is. Yeah, I mean, which, which honestly, like the way he did it doesn't like. Uh, it, it does kind of make sense because he has to go up and down anyway, um, because of fire axe and stuff. And um, mm, you know, so it, it doesn't really matter uh, to bring this guy up and down. You know, so, anyway, so it's gonna be interesting, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you assume he's probably gonna get Imogen back up with the standard lure um, using the drones. So. I would assume so, yeah. Um, but that just means, uh, I mean, he will have an interesting hush, hush timing, who should now be on the stairs, like, soon. Um, so, interested how he'll catch him. 
Yeah, there's a couple of little spots you can get him. Um, three minutes in. Not entirely sure what time he goes to the deprivation chamber. I think it's around five minutes, somewhere around there. Um, Maybe a bit later, but obviously once he's in, once he's in that later, chamber, um, he is uh, pretty much lost. I think he has like a bit, bit of fucking down there, so it probably take a while. Um, there's another fire axe. It's nice. Um, he has interested set up for Hush now. He's just got to get him. It's a coin, a couple of coins down. But he's just going to wait for him to come back up. Well, that works. <laughs> Only got Mogwai to worry about. Final boss of Chongqing. Could probably go and isolate the test subject in this time, but not chancing it. Uh, meanwhile, oh. Speedster is about to throw some scissors. Got and leave it up there again. Has the fire axe in hand, so he's now just got to get back down, get the engineer disguise. Just not entirely sure. Gonna work out the best way out, maybe. Probably going to be across the. Yeah. You know, random chaotic Mokwai and throwing a fire axe into Hush. So, yeah, both of the Hush kill down now. Um, but yeah. up, the, up the Hush kills. And you can just walk into the next room for the perfect test subject. Hmm. Shouldn't be an issue as long as he crouches. Oh no! Oh no way! Oh, uh, I think, was it too fast? I, th I think it was too fast. Like, because he vaulted in, then he stood up, and he, he like didn't crouch he, down again yeah, or something like that. Oh man! He just swung a little bit. Oh, oh no! Speeds to keep going down. Oh, okay. My God! Oh, that's <laughs> happening here. <yeah. laughs> I'm not sure Just saved him by going up again, but he, uh, you know. Threw the, oh. Yeah, he threw the axe off, which obviously lured the guard in. So actually, I don't. Yeah, I don't yeah. actually going down probably would have ripped him there because you can get a bit of wish when you go down, but he's yeah, in the way with that. Not allowed here either. Oh, so yeah, this guy. So this is firmly in Speedson's hands now. Now is it? It was looking. It was actually looking very balanced with those two uh, up yeah. strats, but um, you know, yeah, it's now it's looking, of course looking very kind of. That they they met at a point where it made them even somehow. <laughs> even yeah. Into completely different, completely different routes. Yeah, exactly. So speed says okay. open the front door. Gonna leave the axe down here. Probably he's got free reign. He will still get frisked going through that point. I believe it's a bit of a weird, uh, weird little door. Yeah. Um, we'll get frisked. Yeah, at point. some point in the map, yeah, but you make guards get frisked as well. <laughs> but... Okay, he's choosing to get frisked. I, I, so like, from the first time I played it, I'm not sure what they're actually frisking for. Like, <laughs> <laughs> nothing that, I mean, that they. Uh, what make, would make you illegal to well, carry. Yeah, but, you know. Do. You're in a guard suit. If they find a gun, that's probably a good thing rather than that. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Like, I don't think there's any item that you can carry or any intel or something that so would. You know, make you no, not being able to get frisked. No, you, so I don't know what that's about. You can't physically frisk, obviously, on this game unless you've taken all your items out of your inventory. So he doesn't have any dongles. So he's having a bit of issue getting through. Um, he might choose to just go and isolate Imogen just to make sure she doesn't get yeah. away. I think that's what he's doing. Oh, it makes a lot of sense. Thing. I mean, she stays out there for quite a long time. Oh my god! Oh no! Oh, no. no. No way did that happen. We've seen that no way. Times, <laughs> uh, I've only ever seen that happen in that position with Imogen. I've never seen it throw in front. Yeah. I've seen yeah. It, unfortunately, we've seen that more than once, I think, in roulette. And it's just uh, horrible. Uh, I mean, I haven't, but Imogen is actually so weird. Yeah, oh. it, it, There's something with that stare, though, with Imogen, that, that, that's causing some issues there. Yeah. Like, it's not on these shows. It's, it's, Everything I, and I don't know what, what that is. Oh my god, it's a horrible rip. He's that is right, unfortunate. Right <laughs> so, Randy in the lead again, about two and a half minutes. I mean, Speeds has got a solid route and he knows what he's doing. It's he's, he's that was just so unfortunate. 
And with the lock on as oh, well, he's he's seen it lock on to Vincent for yep, we're good, and then it's just flicked at the last second. As he's oh, pressed my. the free button pretty much. Which... Yeah. <laughs> in, the, in the meantime it's beat the start and immediately body shot a guard. Because <laughs> <laughs> he wanted to lead the evidence with an SMG and yeah, that's <laughs> Wait a little bit. An issue, but, uh... Yeah, it shouldn't. It's kind of funny. Oh man, what, what have we? Oh my god, and now. <laughs> my word. Oh, I think he's fine. <laughs> How? <do> you <laughs> yeah, man, was fine. That? <laughs> oh my god, I hate when that happens, and it can, yeah, it can be such a huge problem. But oh my god, what, what is happening he's in this no, match? No luck with it, the lock -ons. Uh, It's great. Definitely great to see you. <laughs> so now it's gonna be very careful about this one. Yeah, random needs to make. All you have to do is crouch and you're fine. I think last time he just kind of came out of crouch as he uh, yeah. hit him, didn't he? I think. I think so, yeah. It was like a bit too fast, I guess. But oh it's man. <laughs> interesting that random has changed his strat up now. Yeah, he's not in the near guys anymore. Time, yeah. But he has left him, of course, very closely nearby, so that shouldn't be a problem. Oh, um, okay. <laughs> 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 but, but I paused. When he moderated his Twitch chat and he deleted the message of a <laughs> 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 bot. So, <laughs> nice. Keep that clean mid match. Um, but that's a uh, harsh KO'd and should be a kill very, very soon. Yeah, choosing to come back. Okay, no, sorry, he did have the engineer there. Okay, I missed that. I missed him change there. Okay, yeah, so he's gonna have so he has kept his strat. Yep. Uh, just, you know, just easier to traverse, get the block guard. <laughs> it's very nearly ripped. <laughs> and now... To Mogwai. As much as everybody <laughs> wants to kill Mogwai. Uh, wouldn't be good so, right now. Yeah, it's not gonna climb into... <laughs> I mean, it's a bit easier now, because... <gasps> okay, I, I thought he would turn around. No, okay. Uh, yeah, that <laughs> Either yeah, because he isn't facing him, so it's okay. Should be fine, and also he's not trespassing, so... He's just, just, just KO him. Put us out of our misery here. <laughs> he should work. Just... Yeah, she won't come in at all. Nobody will ever... Although he, yeah, he's broke. hostile, but he's not an enforcer. He, he, yeah. doesn't, he doesn't care, so... Um, had time to wait for him. Okay, so he's on to the second part, so now he's just got to go all the way down for the scissors. Um, which is yeah. a little bit of a detour, but not yeah. crazy. Uh, exact detour speedster went on as well, so he's just coming back from that. But of course, um, you know, it's just interesting because, like, uh, speedster's gonna kill Hash now and then has to go go down again, and then Random has to uh, go down as well with a different disguise. So, uh, which could be could be advantageous here. Of course, uh, random is going to be trespassing all the way throughout the facility as well. He, I mean, he's going to—he's only going to have to go in the top of the facility in theory, but obviously the facility engineer is allowed around the uh, facility. So that is true. Yes. Um, you know, random grabbing the scissors. Yeah. I think he shot. I'm pretty sure he shot a drone. Yeah, Mujin is standing up, uh, on top of the stairs. Okay, so. so he's already got Mujin up there. So he's just probably going to take. The Gonna go back behind the restaurant. Take the safe route in. Yep. Meanwhile, Speedster has hushed down. Has a fire axe. Yeah, of course. Oh, oh, like, just needs the facility engineer, but that was, uh, yeah. Uh, you know, worked worked work, work, good out. For, uh, worked out for him last time. Just you know, Speedster was it was so close. He was already done, and then. Uh, yeah. Just. That's true. Super unlucky. Literally, literally the last thing that could go wrong, yeah. <laughs> Shoots a drone. Ooh, oh, he, oh, he shot it. I was too early. Random. Uh, now, okay, it's the mission. That's getting more interesting. <laughs> so, like, random Imogen is leaving now because oh, no. uh, she was standing there for too long and she, you can't look her up there again. No, no, so, you no, have to no, find no, another no. way. So, he's going to have to get. So, now he is going to have to get into the facility. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> what what he is this? that guard mess? accidentally. He's. Uh, he just needs to take a step back here, I think, and just... Oh, man. This is going to be really close. Cause we're, like... I mean, he's too late in to, to even think about a restart now. Seven minutes in, it's it's not. he's not going to be thinking about a restart. He's going to be thinking about how he can get into the facility. 
I mean, getting her on that, where we said last time, by the engineer is an option. But obviously then he has to get the test subject down there. So this is going to be well, really tricky. There's no easy place to get her where the test subject can comfortably get to, I don't think. Unless he's, can you still yeah. shoot all five or does that? Never tried uh, this. That's a good point, actually. I think that should uh, uh, mm, camera, might just work. Out. Yeah, looks. Yeah, looks. She's turning around. Oh, that's oh, smart that's, thinking. That's, that's actually really very smart thinking. And she will be miles ahead of uh, Vincent as well here, so he'll have enough time to get the KOs. He just he'll do a casual stroll whilst she will start virtually running up there. Oh. Um, let's be careful a little bit. Oh, it's in t I mean, it's in the test subject, and uh, it's, it's illegally. Yeah, it could be a bit risky. I better just, yeah, change back to. Um, yeah, I think he's better off just KOing uh, KO both of them. Yes. Oh, my God, it's so close. Oh, Imogen turned around. Um, can I, can I understand? I think the guy that shouldn't have heard that. That shouldn't. She should be far enough back. Um, uh, oh, my God, it's so close. <laughs> yeah, he's fine there. Oh, but she, she, they did. Huh? Oh, did, yeah, they did hear it. Oh, the guard, oh, the guard said no. did hear it. He did hear the uh, the scream of Imogen. Oh my! Speedster had it done two times at two times at the same at the stairs. Oh, it's oh, it's no. It's painful. Oh man, it's oh. <laughs> just so heartbreaking for Speedster. Random. Well, now yeah. Imogen is gonna turn around. She's gonna see the guard. No, she's not gonna see. Okay, yeah. I thought maybe the guards down there would have heard Imogen yeah. scream for random as well, but she didn't even see the knocked out guard. So, very nicely done. Um, I, so I don't even know what to say. Like, that's for the yeah, crazy now. Two really unlucky rips right at the end of his run. Yeah, it's so heartbreaking for Oh yeah. man. It's gonna be a free nail, but uh, as we say a lot of the time, that won't tell the story of the match. Um, yeah, Speeds has got so unfortunate. And that's confirmed, yep, 3 0. Um, yeah, I don't really know what to say after that. That's, that's just <laughs> horrible to oh, see man, someone rip twice in the same place. I mean, yeah. different different ways each time. It's, you've got to be so careful with Imogen on those stairs. If she screams, those guards upstairs. I think will I, I I don't know maybe you can go far enough back that they don't hear her but generally they will always hear her yeah I mean um, <sighs> which is effectively a target lockdown which means they won't be distracted either so um I mean the guard actually was distracted I think so cause, like was far enough away or something I don't know how the sound worked there but maybe because I just, either way uh, it was just really unfortunate both times with Beatster and um but yeah but Randy also had a fair fight it was interesting to see both strats yeah. Um, got a little bit caught up on on Chongqing. Had a solid strat though, and yeah, three nil um, puts him through to the next round. Um, yeah, I think we'll just go straight over to the brackets, and we will see. He should be playing. Yep, it's already updated there, so he will be playing Chris X three in the next round. Um, so we've still got this is actually that's going to be the last of the round two matches to be played um and then we're on to the semi-finals one semi-final already booked in fanium versus blythe um and then chrome x has already booked his place in the uh next one against yeah the winner of random versus chris x3 which i yeah, i think you said they're possibly planning on doing that tomorrow so um we should have an outcome on that one quite soon hopefully yes um, Indeed. Um, sorry. Oh, good. No, no, no. I think yeah. Um, no matches. Yeah, we don't actually have any. We don't have any booked yet. Um, obviously, they do still have a week. Effectively, um, final is next Sunday. Um, so they've got they've got effectively a week to play these matches. So um, hopefully they will kind of spread them out a little bit, and we'll get a little bit of a space um, between them. But we will see. Um, in fun is saying, yeah, Chris, Chris and, and Random will be playing tomorrow, so we'll have one tomorrow, and then Chromex will play the winner of that match. So we're going to be waiting a few days on that one. 
and then uh, yeah, Fanium versus Blythe, and then we're on to finals, effectively. Right at the uh, the sharp end of the tournament now. It's gone by quite quickly. Um, we've had some exciting matches. Indeed. I mean, we had a lot of matches early on, but uh, yeah, uh, great to see all of them. So uh, hyped for tomorrow to see uh, number with Chris, and then uh, next week uh, the few matches that are left. Um, but yeah, all been high quality and entertaining so far, for sure. Yeah. Um, awesome. I don't think there's much else to say. Any final thoughts? Before we uh, call it a day, <laughs> and um, just thank you so much for having me on the cast. It was a it was a pleasure. Yeah, no worries. Um, oh, I think we will. Yeah, I think that's probably about it from us then. Um, yeah, keep an eye on the Discord. Just put that in the uh, chat, and obviously you can see the um, upcoming matches and get pings for when they start um and yeah we will see you hopefully tomorrow for the next match um see you later folks